Yo, what's up guys? My name is the YBN Geek, and in this video we are going to be adding EUP to our 5M server. Some things I need to say before this video begins is you need to have um, the, page, the 5M Patreon uh, bought and activate and have an active EUP key for your server for EUP to work. Once you have all that done and dusted, now we can get into the fun part and add custom EUP to your server. So, some things you will need before this... Some things you will need for this... Some things you will need to add EUP to your server is WinRAR or 7-Zip and Open4. Alright, let's get in. So the first thing you're going to want to do is head over to GTA 5 Mods and click Player. Once you've clicked Player, you're going to see a bunch of uh, clothing items and hair and um, stuff to add to your 5M server. Now once you have found some clothing that you want to add, you're going to click this green download button and another page will pop up and you're going to click this green download button again. Just for the sake of the video, I'm going to be adding a clothing item and hair. Um, they both work the same way, just with different names. Alright, once you have found your item, you're going to open up the folder in WinRAR. Now let me explain what these files are before we get into the video. A YDD is a actual 3D model um, of the clothing you are add, or you are adding, sorry. And a YTD is the texture or texture and textures for that item. So this right here is a, a hair. Uh, you can see it's called hair underscore zero zero one underscore u dot ydd. This is the model of the hair, and this is the texture for it. Now, if there's a readme, always look at that quick and see what it has to say. Now, this here tells us to add it to mp underscore m underscore free mode underscore zero one underscore mp underscore m underscore gun running underscore hair underscore zero one. Now, there's a lot of numbers and things here. UP is definitely confusing, so that's why I'm going to be leaving a link in the description to Toby Space. Toby Space is a GTA 5 asset gallery that shows you everything that is available for, uh, available in the game for male and female. Now, you can place any hair, any clothing, any pants wherever you want, as long as you name the, f as long as you name it what you want it to replace. It, it's kind of hard to explain. But once you do it once and it works, you'll understand. So I'm going to load into my 5M server and find a hair that I haven't used the slot for and replace it with the new hair. So the hair I'm going to be replacing today is MP underscore M free mode underscore zero one underscore hair underscore zero six. Now you don't have to name your hair the same as mine, but this is what hair I'm going to be replacing. So as you can see, it is a normal uh, GTA hairstyle as you can see and we're going to be turning it into the one that we downloaded from 5m from from 5 mods once you are in your server files make a new folder called bracket eup close bracket and when you purchase a 5m key it should give you a folder called eup stream and it will have uh all the regular eup in it um or you can either uh, make a folder called eup-stream and inside it have stream and an fxmanifest.lua. Um, you can find this in the description below. I'll leave a link of where you can find it. Now once you have all these folders ready, so make sure that in your server files you have a folder called eup bra with brackets and closed brackets. Inside that called eup-stream and inside that called stream and fxmanifest. And inside is where you will place your EUP. In order for this hair to work, we have to add MP underscore M underscore free mode underscore zero one and then an arrow. If you're adding a female clothing piece, you're going to put MP underscore F. If you're adding a male clothing piece, you're going to put MP underscore M. So I'm adding a male hair, so I'm going to put MP underscore M underscore free mode underscore zero one hold shift and press six and that will give you this little arrow and it's basically telling the game that the EUP is active kind of in ex explaining it in a easier sense I guess now if you're if you're replacing it in a different slot make sure you put that number slot so I'm replacing it at the six slot um, so I'm gonna put zero zero six if I was replacing it at the ten slot I put zero ten or zero one zero sorry for zero ten now you have to do the same thing 
uh, for the hair, only a little bit different. So for the texture, you're gonna put MP underscore M underscore three mode underscore zero one and the little and the little arrow thing. Now for textures, you always have to make sure that there is underscore D I F F underscore in between um, the hair or in between whatever is here and the numbers. Just to answer a question that someone might have, the reason why there is an A here is because it's the first texture that the clothing piece has. So if this hair had more textures, it would be the same name, but with 006 underscore B, and then your number underscore C, your number underscore D, your, your number underscore E. You can, you can understand where I'm coming from. Basically, the letter is what texture number the model has now you need to keep in mind for clothing pieces um however many textures uh, a model holds you can only have that number of textures so i'll show an example real quick to uh, clear up any confusion because i know this video is probably very confusing and i'm trying my best to explain it so right here at number 14 you can see texture number one of 16 let's say that you had 20 textures of this hoodie and you wanted to add them all you can't you have to pick uh si only 16 of them because they won't go any higher than 16. so this texture would be a this texture would be b this texture would be c this texture would be d and then e and so on and so forth that is what those letters mean and if you have any questions just comment them and i'll try to help you the best i can now, once you have renamed your files, you're going to drag them into your stream folder inside your server files. So that was for hair, so I'm going to show you guys uh, what it looks like if we're adding pants. And this is the same thing for shirts, um, shoes, anything like that. So here's the shorts we're going to be adding. Um, so this, this one is called lower, lower stands for your lower body, and we have to add uh, the things we added before. So go to the model, which is YDD, rename it, and put MP underscore M underscore free mode underscore <clears throat> zero one and that little arrow. Once you have all your files renamed, you can now change the number of what slot you want it to replace. So I want it to replace the second slot um, in my EUP files. So I'm gonna rename all the numbers to zero 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 two. Once you have named, renamed all of your files, you can drag your files into your server files. Now that we have added all of our files, we are going to restart our server and look at our new clothing. Alright, now I added hair and pants, and for me I added it in the second slot. So we're going to view the second slot, and there is our clothing. So that is how you add um, EUP. So again, just an example, this is texture A, this is texture B, this is texture C, this is texture D, and this is texture E. And then the reason why this is glitched is because there's no texture. And here is our hair. Um, if it's green like this, you just gotta save your character and then change the color again um, to, to get the regular hair color back. Sometimes the uh, 5M will do that, and it's just a little bug. But yeah, it's, that is how you add EUP to your server. Um, I tried to explain it the best I could. Uh, I apologize if the video was a little bit confusing. Um, but if you have any questions, just leave them down in the comments and I'll do my best to answer. Yeah, if you like the video, make sure to like it and subscribe to the channel so you never miss an upload on how to do stuff for your Fabum server. Thank you so much and I'll talk to you all in the next one. Peace.